if you were to kick a door open and it like someone's on the other side and it whacked them, would that be your fault? Mm, yes. Because you kicked it forcefully. Oh, if that was my hands are full. I don't know. But do you have to like kick it like I don't know my own power. Do you have to kick it like Hey, awesome. How are these things happening? Oh yeah, dude, watch it. Oh yeah. Feeling pretty pumped today, guys. Oh, what the heck? My quads turned my car off. <laughs> it's gonna be a good day today, dude! Oh. Damn, this car's powerful. I'm doing the sick angles. Max is meeting a girl. He doesn't know I'm here. I'll be out a second. Bye. Okay, maybe he knows. Maybe he knows I'm here. Okay, time to switch positions. Oh shit. Hey, dude. How do you find it? We gotta be cinematic. This is, what, this is what Christian does, right? Yeah, yeah. And his car. And his car is cooler than Christian. Hey, what the hell? Come back. What's up guys? A little different environment today. We are at the shop gym, which is about 25 minutes further away than my gym. This is where my deadlift competition was at, that I failed miserably at. Here's the clip. <laughs> we're gonna go out there, we're gonna try to do our best. Alright. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're gonna do some deadlifts, have a good day. It's uh, Easter's. Did you not tell them that they were the Lord's chips? Those, those cards are on freak. What? Not, what? Nothing? <laughs> Alright guys, so last week we did 500 pounds for three sets of five. This week we're gonna do... I have no idea. But at least 500, maybe like 510, 515, 620, 700, I don't know. We're gonna hop into an edit in three, three, two, two, one, one, no, 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 a zero. I rip my hand. I wear my bed. Me and my cousin touch wieners. Look at this, guys. Let's take a deep one. That's disgusting. Just say, are you ready? I'm ready. You are ready. I am ready. On the count of three, start dancing to this song. No, I'm not. One, two, three, go. Christian's willing to make the internet think that he literally broke up with Heidi for a thumbnail. Heidi. Really cool, feel like a heart, like torn apart. Yeah, babe. Anything for the views. Let's all get the girls, dude. This face right here. Look at, look at the camera, baby. Uh, uh, yeah. Wait, I'm a Christian, huh? Keep going! No, one more, dude! I can't! There was a dark point in my life where, you know, I felt like I was a rock bottom. I didn't know what else to do. Couldn't get motivated to do anything. Just want to lay in my bed all day. And then I, I learned how to do abdominal crunches. And slowly but surely, I, I started forming a six-pack. And my life 
Everything has changed since that day. I knew I was destined for more in life, and getting shredded was that. And motivating other people to get shredded AF. What else is there, dude? Nothing. Forget money, forget girls, just get shredded. And then blink, blink really slowly. I know it's gonna hurt, but you know what it's like to You know, but in all seriousness, my life did get better when I started lifting weights. I just like the troll, guys. Let's see if we have a bleeder, guys. Oh, yeah. That's one hidden, hidden uh, feature of the compression pants is it hides your bloody shins from deadlift. Man, if only, like, I came out with, like, deadlift socks or something. You know, I always, like, troll and, like, joke around when I'm making fitness videos, and that's just, like, for funsies. I should... You think we should like one day do like an entire workout where like I'm serious like entire time? Like at, like not even like trolling serious, like actually serious. But even when the camera's not rolling, like at the, like at the no, gym, the we just. The only time I've ever like, seen you work out seriously is the Ever Forward video. Yeah. I just like having a good time. Like, <sighs> it's funny. It's like Christian makes fun of me sometimes for like always joking around in the gym, and I'm like Christian, I can still troll you and deadlift like 400 pounds more than you at the same time, dude. Look at those veins, dude. Bro, I have like no bicep peak at all. Like, look at this. People be like, oh my god, Max, it's, it's close. You have to do preacher curls, Max. You have to do preacher curls for the bike. Shut up. Damn, I'm tired. I'm hungry. Tonight, we're going to go see Ready Player One. Do you really want to go watch that or do you want to play Fortnite? Well, I suck at Fortnite. Guys, I got uh, officially partnered with Twitch, so I'm verified on Twitch. Plug again, Max underscore tuning. Come follow me on Twitch. Hang do out. Again, watch do that again, dude. Twitch right there, dude. Come hang out. Subscribe. Watch me suck at Fortnite. Actually, here's some Fortnite clips. Got him? That's two more Nilo. Oh, got, got one. one. It's Oh. He's one shot. Wow, took his shield off. Got him. Boom! Snipe God, bro. Leave his loot. Leave his loot. Snipe God. Haha, <laughs> you suck, Max. <laughs> Disruptism, dude. Whatever, dude. Is that even a real word? Disruptism? Disruptism. I don't think so. Max, what are you doing? Yeah. Don't jump, dude. Yeah, it's gonna look sick. Russell will be like... You mad, Russell? Dude, you couldn't even reach this if you tried, boy! Before we go in the movies, I have 175 cars left in the day. Uh, so we got to California tortillas, which is like... Chipotle's like ugly cousin uh, in terms of comparison, but just lettuce, meat, veggies, no sauce, no rice, saving my carbs for candy. James Halliday saw the future, and then he built it. He gave us a place to go, a place called the Oasis. Pretty good movie. It basically was a visual orgasm. Would recommend, dude. Some people think that summer shredding is all about eating less food to get a sick six-pack abs. On the contrary, my friends, you must fuel your body with proper nutrients. Let's go in the grocery store and pick up some stuff. Do you always get that many apples, dude? Um, well, yeah, see, Kellen, apples don't really go bad that quickly, so I just stock up. And I got one of the stupid Fiji or Fuji. We're gonna make some meat and sauce tonight for dinner. A lot of people come in, they just grab one, they just, you know, just, just whatever. 
that's when you can end up with 80 20. You don't want that. I mean, this is how much? What the heck, the macros? Where's the macros? 21 grams of fat per serving. <laughs> that's, that's fine, right? This one is four and a half grams of fat. Now, sometimes when you make like meat and but I thought I thought stuff. I thought more fat was better, dude. Uh, That's why, like. No, 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 no. no. Oh, okay. Next up is finding some sauce. Now, some people are like, oh my God, Max, make your own sauce. Go get no hell no. Why would I make my own sauce when they've done it for me? You can get the prego. Is that is that a is that is that a, is that a joke I made? It? I was gonna make a. Yeah, maybe we should get prego for Kelvin. <laughs> Important for my smoothies every day is frozen fruit. Got some big old strawberries, some fruit blends, strawberries, mango chunks, and pineapple. I mean, heck, what else should we get? Blueberries, sure. Everyone keeps telling me to try like oikos, more like oiknos. I stay with light and fit. I got you guys. Can I have a, a pound of the Salsalito turkey? A uh, slice regular, please. Guys, I'm not even playing. If you go to your local deli and they have boar's head, get Salsalito. It's the We're gonna get this Nature's Own double fiber wheat. You know, I don't know who what the YouTube channel is, but there's some like older woman that has, like, she's like a dietitian or something, but she posts some video that's like reviews people who like eat food. I guess like, reviews fitness YouTube. I don't know. She reviews something, but she made a whole video basically just like killing me because of my day of eating videos, which she doesn't understand this entertainment stuff. And I remember I went to get like bread, and she like was like, <laughs> honey wheat. I would never eat honey wheat bread my entire life. Then she said my intelligence was low. Well, that's probably true, but she said my intelligence was low because of the food I eat. I'm like, no, my intelligence is low because I'm stupid. But, uh, got all the groceries, guys. Let's head back to the house. Spin! Bro, you messed up the transition. <laughs> so since stupid Chipotle is closed on Easter, we have to make, we have to make our own food, get to fend for ourselves. So, we got some whole grain rotini pot. Did you guys know, fun fact, I used to think uh, the shapes of pasta were just like for fun. Like sometimes you wanted to eat like an elbow or you know a spiral, like a little slide or something. But apparently it's, it holds the sauce differently. Oh my God, I'm such a chef, right? So we have uh, one and a half servings each of this pasta. We have one pound of 90 ground beef gonna put it all in this pot right now and we have two servings each of sauce because again I like my pasta like I like my girls extra saucy Just put it all in there yeah. my spoon. this just kind of mix it up to show the people the sick food dude Ooh. yeah literally this is my favorite type of food just like meat sauce Pasta all in a little container. Yeah, you're... Like that. We got some cayenne. What? It doesn't even fog up, dude. It's so sick. I know. Oh. Cayenne red pepper. The last red pepper I had expired in 2011, so I decided to get rid of that. Cayenne seasons. <laughs> Caffeine free bang. Cotton candy. It's pretty good, but it's like. It's like. The, the cotton candy is like really apparent as the flavor, but like it's almost like too much of a sweet flavor. I don't know, but. We're gonna crush this food now! Hey, dude. Oh, good morning, man. What are you doing? Um, I'm just trying to get some motivation for YouTube and stuff. I'm checking out Christian's new um, new video title. I told my parents Heidi's pregnant. Um, I think he's slowly but surely becoming the Jake Paul of our <laughs> of our fitness community. <laughs> I, I wonder what your guys' thoughts are on like clickbait and stuff. Because me and Joe. Joe and I always give him so much crap, and uh, he's like, his comeback is always the same. It's always like, yeah, talk to me, and you're getting 270,000 views. I'm like, I'm like, I get Christian. 
I get it, dude. You're more popular than us, dude. You get more views than us. Your calves are smaller than ours. Like, you know, you don't have to keep telling us or reminding us. But, like, what are your thoughts? Like, obviously, you know, I try to lure you in, but, like, in, in, in my opinion, clickbait's like, if I was to run over someone's toe on accident in my car and it was just like a gentle thing, and they're like, dude, you ran over my toe or something, and then the title was, I hit my friend with my car, and then he was like laying in front of the car for the thumbnail. Like, I think that's a little extreme. <laughs> like, that's something, you know? It's like, do you think Christian would have played that joke on his parents if he didn't need a YouTube title? But at the end of the day, it's all marketing. It's all business, I guess. But what are your thoughts? Do you accept it? You just, is it just part of what it is? Let's do a weigh-in to wrap up this video, guys. Let's check it out. Feeling shredded. I, I found it hurtful. 166.6, dude, that, isn't that 666? That's like the number of the beast, dude. Makes sense. Shredded beast. But uh, we're down, <laughs> we started at 168. We're at 166.6. That's point seis in Spanish. But uh, yeah, diet's going well. Christian, or oh, I almost called you Christian, dude. You're way better looking than Christian. Kelvin and I are... I find, I, find it, I find it hurtful because I have a child on the way. Yeah. Look at that, Christian. You're... Hurting my feelings. Yeah, how dare you, dude? And then Max calls me... What I do? What? Max calls me Christian, dude. Thank you guys for watching the video. Smash the thumbs up button. And I'll see you later, dude. You gonna do a quickie in there? And Get out, out, man! Okay. Uh